well it is another tourney wednesday this week i am gonna be fishing alone ryan has a work meeting he's got to attend and one of my other buddies he thought he was gonna be able to make it but he's gonna be at work late so it's all alone tonight guys just me and it is gonna be a grinder it's gonna be rough i believe because there's a big storm coming through i think here for the first hour or so before the big storm comes they may be pretty good but after that storm starts hitting i think the bike's gonna probably shut off um, this place always whenever it starts raining it's iffy on what ends up happening so i'm heading out there now gonna get entered as long as the tournament's still on if it's if, if there's not many people here because of the rain they probably won't have it and in that case I will still go fish anyway. So I'm heading out there right now. We will see what happens when I get there. Well, it is raining, not too bad, but I don't wanna risk it and bring my camera out and get it ruined. So I'm gonna leave my camera in the truck today and I'm just gonna fish with both my GoPros running. Like I said, I'm alone, so I'll uh, do the best that I can today. So I'm leaving my camera in here. I'm going to launch boat right now. We will see you guys on the water when I get my boat in. Always fun when you're the last one to the boat. We're just kind of going to go with the flow tonight since we're alone. Do what we know works. Let's see if we can't grab just a few right off the rip. I want this hood up because it's raining, but at the same time, that hood's annoying me tonight. There's some fish out here. I'm hoping there'll at least be one going down this bank that I'm able to pick off here real quick. But you never know, if these fish are moving around so much, they may just not even be here. Okay, I think I'm gonna move, get rolling after one more cast, and then I'll come back later to this area. All right. That ride hurt like crazy. Holy crap, it started picking up as soon as I went to go across the lake. Is that a fish? Oh, there's a fish, that's a nice one. That's a nice one. Oh, that's a freaking carp. Okay, good. What in the world? I thought that was gonna be a nice bass. I have a feeling now that since the rain started a little earlier than I thought, it may be a little bit rough tonight. I'm hoping not. I'm hoping everything picks up and I can catch some fish, but we're going one at a time like usual, just trying to get a fish tonight. There's a one. I don't know if he's gonna measure though. Yep, he's 11. See ya, buddy. Yeah, well, got one fish. Not a keeper, but at least I caught one so far. I'm gonna swap to something else. Come on, let's at least just get one fish right here. One fish at a time. It'll make it work. There's a fish. I don't know if it's... A, uh, it's, of course, a dink. I think. He may, he may keep. 
I doubt it, but he may. He's right on 12. We'll throw him in there. <laughs> Not happy about that one, but more than we just had a second ago. Well, I guess it's time for another spot. I don't know if that was a fish or not. It had to have been. That absolutely had to have been a fish. Oh, there's one. There she is. It's a decent one. All right, solid two pounder. I need to get another Senko. One fish at a time, baby. I knew that guy hit the time before. It was literally in the exact same spot. 6.43, so we got two hours to go. Got two fish. I think just working one at a time, we'll be able to get to three more. All right, we're gonna do another spot change. fish I think now is when the big moves got to come because we got barely over an hour an hour and 15 minutes need to make something happen even if it just means another 12 inch fish so be it all right well that didn't work we are going to try something new I haven't tried this before guys like I said a little bit over an hour I know I can go certain places and have a, probably a high chance of catching them, but this area, I think I've got a high chance of catching multiple. At least I'm hoping for it. We're going to go rapid fire, back to back to back, over and over cast as fast as I can. So I can get to the area where at least I know fish are or at least should be this time of night. Is that a fish? There we go. Ah, it was tiny and it's not gonna keep anyways. All right, let's get going to my last spot. All I can hope is that there's fish on this bank. Earlier, wasn't anything when I first went by it. Guys, it's been a slow and kind of rough night. I mean, I've caught four or five fish, but the majority of them are just small. It'd be nice just to get one more fish. Like I said, I'm just working one at a time. It's all that you need to do out here. There's one. Oh my gosh, I don't know if it was small or not. It looked like it would have barely been a keeper, but oh my gosh. There we go. He's a 12.
Come on, one more fish. It's been working somewhat. Come on, one more fish. Oh, there's one. Oh, he just came off and it was a decent one. Oh my gosh. That's the third fish I've lost tonight. Really? I was trying to decide if I should keep mine or not, but I'm, I may. Two. Four thirty-two. Well, I just got home, got some stuff taken out of the boat because it poured all night long while I was fishing. But as you saw, I got three fish to weigh in. Those three fish were 4.32 pounds. I lost four other fish throughout the night, and that was kind of annoying, but you know, nothing I can do now other than just fish better a little bit next time. So, ended up having three fish though. Winner had four fish for 11 or 12 pounds, and I was second with 4.32 pounds. So another somewhat victory, getting second place. We're still shooting for another first this year. So we're at third, first, and second for the first three weeks of the tournament out there at our local lake. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna finish getting everything put away from tonight's trip. But anyways, thank you for watching, and we will see you in the next one.